Good morning and happy Sunday. I'm meteorologist Steve Teeling here at News 8. We are checking out a pretty decent day out there. Now it's going to be cooler than what we've seen the last couple of days. High temperatures should be in the low 50s, which is pretty close to average for this time of year. So overall, not a bad day. It looks like it stays quiet and dry for the next couple of days, but then we'll be watching for the potential of some rain and wind to come in Tuesday night. Continue into Wednesday before tapering off the showers, but right now Thanksgiving Day is looking pretty decent. Let's take a look at that full forecast here for you. Today, we're looking at a mostly sunny day, a breezy day, high temperatures in the low 50s, winds will be west at 10 to 20 miles an hour. Some afternoon clouds may mix in, especially later in the day in our northern counties, but other than that, we should have a pretty dry and comfortable day. Overnight tonight, it'll be another cold one under mostly clear skies. Inland areas in the 20s, shoreline temperatures will be in the low 30s, and the eight-day forecast for the shoreline calls for a breezy day, as we mentioned today, but nice. Quiet and cooler tomorrow, high of 45. Then on Tuesday, clouds roll in by evening and into the overnight. It'll become rainy and windy. That rain continues Wednesday morning before tapering off to just some scattered showers in the afternoon. Thursday right now for Thanksgiving looks windy, but partly cloudy, and it remains breezy into Friday. Your inland temperatures are going to be even cooler, high of 41 tomorrow, 43 on Tuesday. So that's kind of a cold rain that's going to fall Tuesday night on into Wednesday morning. Inland areas for Thanksgiving on Thursday looks like it'll be 44 degrees, windy under partly cloudy skies. Meteorologist Sam Cantrell will be in later on tonight. He'll have the very latest on our local forecast.